Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. Alright everybody, as we discussed in yesterday's video, Midori who is a well known Sega and Atlas leaker but occasionally gives some details on Nintendo news as well, has revealed that they know about two Mario games that are in development which will most likely come to the Switch too. One Mario game that they've heard about and they know for sure and the other they haven't heard about in a while. So for the sake of this video, we're only going to talk about the one Mario game because the other one could have been scrapped. Now as they stated on Twitter, there is a project at Nintendo in development with the codename SP Red. Red is Mario's codename, which is very true. Now. Just to give you details on this, Mondo Mega on Twitter has given us a breakdown of all the red codename Mario games and here it is. As they stated here, that's a mainline Mario game from 3D Land onwards, they have all had codenames that used red. And specifically for all the Mario games on the Switch, yeah, Red Star for Super Mario Odyssey, Red Pro Slash S for New Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe, you have Red Carpet Slash S for Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury, and SEC Red for Super Mario Brothers Wonder. Now the SP Red game that Midori is talking about, they don't know what it is, but it is believed that this could be a brand new 3D Mario game. A lot of people think that this will be a Super Mario Odyssey Part 2, but I'm going to be honest with you, I don't think it will be a Super Mario Odyssey Part 2. I think that this Mario game will be the first open world 3D Mario game. And we first heard about this information by someone that a lot of people don't like online, but I really don't care about that. I'm here to report the news because Zippo, back in September of last year, was the very first person to talk about this game, possibly being an open world Mario game. And hey, let's get into the details. Now, as they posted on their blog spot on September 24th, 2023, the next 3D Mario is open world launches next year. Now at the time, Zippo, as well as damn near every other leaker slash insider thought that the Switch 2 would be launching sometime in 2024. But we all know that internally, supposedly, that Nintendo scrapped those plans and they're now launching this console sometime in this fiscal year, most likely at the beginning of 2025. And I have to say that because although this information is so-called old news, it's still relevant to what we're talking about today. Now, with all of that in mind, here's what Zippo shared. Firstly, it's going to be our very first open world 3D Mario game. It's been six long years since Odyssey hit the scene, so we knew they were cooking something big. Giving Zelda and Pokemon have taken the plunge, it was only a matter of time before the portly plumber did as well. This game will not be a sequel to Odyssey, so if you're expecting that, don't. This is going to be an entirely different direction. I've been told the game looks absolutely jaw dropping. If you thought Mario vs Donkey Kong looked good, then you haven't seen anything yet. EPD Tokyo is about to blow people's effing minds yet again. Lastly, this will be the game for Nintendo next year. Mario will be a day one Switch 2 game and I would bet serious amounts of money that this will be the very first game that we will see running on their shiny new system. This will be the first 3D Mario game to be a launch title since 1996's Super Mario 64, which means this is a big freaking deal. Expect a very strong launch lineup from Nintendo and third parties alike. Next gen is almost here and Mario will be the one to welcome us into it. Get ready. So there you all have it. Now let's keep in mind here that Nintendo has not confirmed any of this information as of yet, but I do want to stress something here that this open world Mario game could be the same exact game that Midori is talking about, the code name that they have heard about the SP Red game. And hey man, if this is true, this will be a big deal for Nintendo because this, like Zippo said here, will be the first open world Mario game. And Zippo also said here that this Mario game will be a day one Switch 2 game, which I can see happening. Of course, we don't know this for sure at this point in time, but I think that in Nintendo's very first trailer for the Switch 2, when they showcase a couple of games, that this, like they said as well, will be the first game we see running on this Switch 2 console because Nintendo has to show off the capabilities of this brand new console. And hey, the best way to do this is to do it with their mascot, the plumber, Mario. Now, like I said before, I know a lot of people don't like Zippo for whatever reason, and hey, that's cool, it is what it is, but I'll just say this. Zippo has got a couple of things wrong in the past and a lot of things right in the past as well. And just to give you an example of this with a Mario game specifically, Super Mario Brothers Wonder, I mean, hey, they were the very first person to talk about this online and they just about got everything right about Super Mario Brothers Wonder. So we cannot deny that fact. And I'm saying that to say this, that they were right about Super Mario Brothers Wonder and they could be 100% correct about this brand new open world Mario game for the Switch too. Only time will tell. 
Now, before we end this video, I know a lot of you out there watching are now subscribed to this channel and I really don't know why because I check my analytics and most of you watch all of my videos anyway. So hey man, hit that subscribe button, show your support, stop being weird and hit that like button as well. As always, remember to keep it locked here at Around the Clock, where here we focus on Nintendo news content around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next video.